Welcome back to Cooking Edition of Running Hermit channel. Today we will be using beetroot as a main ingredient. Beetroot, also simply known as a beet, is recently gaining high popularity as a new superfood. Due to current studies claiming that the beets and beetroot juice can improve athletic performance, lower blood pressure, and increase blood flow. New products incorporating this highly nutritious food are sprouting everywhere, especially in juices and drinks. While these products are rather pricey, raw beets, especially in Europe, are amongst the cheapest vegetables on the market. Beetroot used to be a common ingredient in the past, but during the second half of the 20th century almost disappeared from daily use. That is why I'm not cooking typical Icelandic meal today, but instead I will prepare with you borscht, typical rich and filling soup originating in Russia and Ukraine. Although I will prepare soup with meat, you can easily skip it and make vegetarian version instead. For 8 portions I will use 800 grams of beetroot, 3 potatoes, 1 cup of onion, 1 cup of carrots, 3 cups of white cabbage, 2 spoons of sugar, salt, bay leaves, 100 grams of tomato puree, 2 spoons of vinegar, 4 spoons of oil, pepper, bouillon, 350 grams of ground beef, and sour cream for topping. To process beetroot, I suggest to use shredder or electronic robot to avoid juice to get on your clothing. Beetroot is strong dye, which is almost impossible to get out of your clothes. Now we have all ingredients ready, so let's get cooking. Heat up oil in a large pot. Add onions and stir until glazed. Mix with minced meat and stir for about 2 minutes. Now it's time to add beetroot. Blend it until warm, about 3 to 4 minutes. Add sugar and tomato paste for a sweet taste. Put about 2 liters of water. Add all spices and veggies except potatoes. Stir, cover and cook on low heat for about 30 minutes. Add potatoes and keep cooking for another half an hour. If you would add them at the beginning, they would start dissolving in a soup and making more dense. After one hour of slow boiling, the soup is almost ready. Check the taste and add bouillon and vinegar if necessary. After five minutes, we are ready to serve. Borscht is traditionally presented with a spoon of sour cream, which gives it nice taste as well as looks well. Here we go! Bon appetit! I hope you have tried and enjoyed this recipe. Please let me know what you think. Do you use beetroot in your diet? Do you believe in its benefits? Thank you for watching my channel and see you next time.